Here we go, I'm going to show you a lot like um, my bottle growing. And uh, this is a, um, a fig I put in about five days ago, maybe four. You see, look, it's really healthy. It hasn't dried out. So I'll, do, I'll leave it in there until, uh, until you can see the roots anyway. I'm going to show you how, how basically I uh, do a, like a bottle greenhouse. I'll show you a few other little things. This area is, um, when I'm walking around, if I see anything I like, I've usually got my bottle with me. I take my, I take my cuttings, I chuck it straight into the bottle. I've got like um, water with a bit of um, root hormone in there. And then this cinnamon has been, been in there for about four days. There's loads of little white specks. That's the roots going to start coming through. So the, it's definitely working, it's rooting. And then what I'll do. I'm probably going to transfer these sticks into one of these. I've got holes on the bottom. So I'll put the sticks into these and then once, once I see them rooting, once I see all the roots coming through, then I'll pot them outside. But um, yeah, I thought I'd just quickly show you. Uh, basically we do uh, a bit of bottle growing put a little uh, slit on the side There you have it. Fill it with some soil. You can do your seeds in it, your cuttings in it, but cuttings work really well. So that's bottle growing. What I'm going to try right now is a bit of, um, I've got two bits of lemongrass I had in the fridge for a while. So I'm going to plant those in and then update it to show you if it works. But yeah, bottle growing, greenhouse growing, whatever you want to call it. This works.